And moving on, the late King Father was a beloved king to his people and his country, Cambodia, is still mourning his death. Our correspondent Sandy Saputra spoke to a former ambassador who has served under the late uh, King Father from 1991 through 1999 and became the king's personal friend. Here's a close look at the man that became one of Cambodia's greatest kings. Ambassador Mili, thank you very much for your time to talking to us. Uh, my first question is, you've known the king for a very long time. You've worked together with him personally. How do you see the man? First of all, you know, he's beside being my boss direct for, you know, from 20, October 23, 91. Yeah. I see him in different conference and so on. I must say that he's a his wholeness of human being. He a humanist, is a poet, an artist, you know, and also social worker. Well, Cambodia certainly have had uh, gone through a turbulent time. Uh, how, how was the king during that time, uh, during the low point of Cambodia? He see uh, Cambodian in a, you know, miserable way. He sometimes cry in within himself, you know, in front of miserable things and so on, so on. Sometimes we feel, you know, very sad that we cannot help. He really has the pushing from inside, want to help, to do something for his children. Ambassador, the king has been called many things, the father king, uh, an independence hero. How do you see him? What is his biggest legacy for Cambodia? Peace peace and you know peace of mind peace of social peace that is the condition for the reconstruction the rebuilding the the country well the late king sihanouk has been called a mercurial diplomat he has many friends around the world including china how did he see china for me i see that uh, that is a very uh, the faithfulness of both sides, you know, from Chu and Lai, you know, Prime Minister Chu and Lai, and him, uh, uh, you know, faithfulness of friendship. So China understand him. He understand China. This is one big, you know, uh, point: the understanding, and also uh, no, uh, you know, uh, mingle in the internal affairs.